hi guys welcome you guys back to my youtube channel it's me your girl esther thank you all so much for always stopping by thank you for if it's your first time of coming across my channel you are welcome to this amazing family god bless you so this video i am about to be uploading you know i'm going to be reacting to videos okay so thank to my new subscriber thank to my old subscriber thank you guys so much for always coming back to watch my video whenever i upload a new video please if it's your first time don't forget to hit the subscribe button don't forget to hit the uh, notification bell so that whenever i drop a new video you will be the first person to watch it god bless you and this is my channel we talk about a whole lot good news bad news everything at all you can talk about we talk about it we analyze it we give advice you we talk about a whole lot we talk with pidgin english we talk with correct english you know we don't just stand on one really um english we are uh, maybe we they talk in nigeria english we they talk you know oh go get matter where we say where we go learn from things where we go help us then we always they break on this channel so i also make a just call appreciate everybody thank you all so much for always coming back to watch my video god bless you i love you all thank you so much stay safe in jesus name amen thank you all so much i love you please don't forget to share my video always share my video like it uh, uh, thumbs up for me whenever i upload any video you watch it you like it at the end of the video please don't forget to hit the uh, subscribe button the notification bell so that whenever i drop a new video youtube will notify you thank you so much love you bye good morning everyone my name is Shed francis odige aka yellow no Muse worldwide aka the bone lioness i'm a mom i'm a, I'm, I'm, I'm mrs Os osemi game because i'm married but my official and name is my entertainment name is Shed francis odige yes I've come here as a mother to cry to everyone, to cry to Nigerians as, at large, to cry to the world at large. Please, this is a crying mother needing a help from Nigerians, from the world at large, for foreign bodies, NGOs, women organization, human rights. I'm calling for your help. I'm calling for you to fight this fight for me. Yes, I'm happily married, but I had a child for my ex-baby, baby dad when we were dating he met me and i was a uh, he met me started dating me at the age of 32. when i was 35 we dated for three years when i was 35 i became pregnant of this my child which he had first forced me to 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 get rid of the, the first pregnancy i had for him this second time he said it was head bent on me doing it again i fell for his sugar-coated tongue i fell for his sugar-coated tongue i dated him because he said he's a businessman based in Nigeria mostly. So the woman he has abroad will not cross paths with me. But when I became pregnant, he started fighting me that the woman abroad will kill him. You understand? So I said, but you knew you were married. Why were you delaying me? When he came into my life, he broke my SIM card. He was telling me to be telling people that I'm engaged. He will be chasing me away from me. If man says hi, he will go and fight the man. You know? So I was, I had, I left no, I had no option than to stick to him. In, at the end of three years, when I was pregnant, he started using talks to fight me. He started threatening my life. I had to, that I have to remove the pregnancy. You know, out of fear, I went to call him at area command. I called him at area command. I wrote a petition against him. And they told him that what he's telling me to do is against Nigeria law, that he should go back. You understand? He tried to bribe me. He said he would give me 1.5 million. He would give me a plot of land. He would give me the Elmer Jeep I was driving. He said he would leave it for me. I said the child I have not given birth to. You are prizing all these things on her life. I will not. He tried to force me. He tried to push me. I did not. So finally, I had my child. Diamond, come. Finally, I had my child. From nine months, at the due of nine months till date, since I gave birth to this child till now, he has not seen my child's face. This is my child. This is my child. He has not seen my child's face. 
So, I'm calling on well-meaning Nigerians. So, please, join me on this fight. If it doubts the paternity of my child, it should come for a DNA test. I, the mother of my child, I'm challenging the father of my child, Dumezedo. His name is Dumezedo, a.k.a. Eru Wailanwand of Amsterdam. If it doubts the paternity of my child, it should come for a DNA test. It should come for a DNA test. Please, Nigerians all over the world, foreign bodies, People of the world at large, I'm calling on everyone to join me on this cry of a mother. I'm calling because I have to, I have to come out to face the world to say, I'm guilty. I dated a married man, but he was the one who lured me into it. He pleaded with me and influenced me with everything possible within his possible means. So I said, okay, the devil you know is better than the angel you don't, don't know. Because I've dated a guy who is married before and he posed to me as a single guy. Being halfway in the relationship, I discovered he was married. So, now that this one said he's married and, he, and he's ready to be responsible, that was why I followed him. But if you feel I'm wrong, have a way in your heart to forgive me. Do not look onto that. Join me in the fight of, my, of an innocent child for this man, Dumezedo, a.k.a. Eru Wailan, one of Amsterdam, to come and take, to come and play the fatherly role in the life of my child. I can take care of my child single-handedly. I'll be taking care of her right from the day of delivery till now. But I want him to come in the life of my child because I do not want her to go and face shame at her, at her age, at her, at, her, at her teenage age or adulthood. That's why I'm facing, I'm carrying this shame now as a mother because I'm the one who followed him. I'm standing in the gap of my child to call on every well-meaning Nigerians to come and join me to call this man, Dumezedo, a.k.a. Eru Wailan, one of Amsterdam, to come and do a DNA test. If he doubts the paternity of my child, I want his, he stops his family from coming close to me and my child. He stops his friends from coming close to me and my child. What did, which offense did I commit because I said I want to have my child and I wasn't the one who came to beg you. Please, Nigerians, all over the world, wherever you are, I'm swallowing my pride. I'm swallowing, I'm carrying this shame because of my child. Because I don't want my child to be mocked later. Because if this man has told me that he's an irresponsible man who will not care for his child, I will not even date him. I will not even take a penny from him. I will not even, 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 even eat, drink one thing with him, not talk of lying on his bed. Please, I'm calling on well-meaning Nigerians to join me in this cry. Join me in this cry. Pastors, pastors, actors, Nollywood actors, because I'm also a Nollywood actor, but I do most of my jobs in Benin. Please, pastors, Nollywood actors, um, Tunde Ednot, everybody, everybody. Oye kere, ha 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 specialist, tomorrow she will run out and come and say, you went and beg her, and hey, did you really sleep with me? Una ye? Ha 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 Because not true. He go fit talker. So now what in the fear? Now be that. If not, he would have run to beg me and say, ah, my sister put matter for ground. <laughs> <laughs> he's 
said, I don't know him. But this idiot man practically sat down on one low life page yesterday and was claiming he knows me that I call him. She called me, oh, she do call me, oh, eh, de, 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 oh. Ah, da, 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 da. but now he's saying this is the conclusion of the video. You people should go to my YouTube and go and hear. He said, I'm a good friend. He used his mouth to say it. How I called him and beg on behalf of Oje Gile for what Oje Gile did to him and his wife. That Lolo is a good friend. He's on my YouTube channel. Go and listen to it. He said Lolo is a good friend. Lolo begged me and I let go of the matter. But I was surprised why Oje Gile was still insulting me. Because Oje Gile was angry and she heard all the rubbish that he said about her okay he heard it he heard everything this was the yesterday oh. when did they run mat on lolo <laughs> Was yesterday on look at look, look at himself <laughs> 2023 awards <laughs> that was when he was running his mouth last year they left us here fail they should call him my brother why will you be the one they call you go there be you know go there <laughs> my brother you reach that jungle that a keke not better way you reach there be you know reach there <laughs> i beg they say your husband dna fail now you they can't even <laughs> Hello?